Right, take three of this video. <laughs> Sorry about that, got the camera, but uh, the phone rather. So anyway, I've not been quite getting full boost and I've been chasing this problem for quite a while. Now, this is a lesson in why it's worth investing in the right tools. So, I've got these little nifty things that you plug in one end um, to detect a boost leak. And now all I'm going to do is I've got it hooked up to a pipe and a bit of steel pipe there. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to blow in the end here and you're going to hear the boost leak on the other side. Okay, let me, let me blow it and I'll move the camera over. You hear that? There's the boost leak. Now what I'm gonna do is if I can place the camera. Oh I think I can. Okay, let me uh try and maneuver myself. There we have it. There's your boost leak. So this pipe I, I ordered recently, um, normally for the top one I thought you could get away with putting it on this one. Looks like that's not the case. It's the same diameter. I've tried two different clips, still didn't work. So I've ordered a brand new pipe for the bottom now, the lower one, the actual right one. And I think that should be the nightmare over. And I should have full boost back. Anyway, um, while I'm here, I'll show you the two things I ordered. And here they are. Quite simple, just a rubber end. Flexible, you can plug it into any hole you want. Then attach some uh, smoke machine to it. Or just do what I did and blow into it. So there you are. I'm a happy man tonight. Thanks for watching. See you again.